And if you've been to New London, New Hampshire, and you enjoy locally fresh food, it's likely you've made a stop at Spring Ledge Farm. In the year 2005, Spring Ledge had been in business for around 30 years when Greg Berger and his family purchased it. YCN's Lynn Solomon made a stop of her own at Spring Ledge Farm and caught up with Greg to find out about seasonal crops and a secret recipe for locally grown corn. It's fresh from the farm, from Spring Ledge Farm, and joining me is Greg Berger, owner, and it's the lovely month of August. We yes. wait all year for all the great stuff to come out of the ground mm -hmm. August. in August. Yes. So August what do you have? Is, it's harvest time at the farm, for sure. We have uh, harvesting everything from arugula to zucchini, really. Okay. Um, I'd, I'd like to touch on the sweet corn, which is one of our Spring Ledge specialty crops. It is. Uh, we grow on fields all around town, so you know it's local. We pick every single morning. Uh, and we have it here at the farm stand by the time we open at nine. Uh, and the reason we pick every morning is because as you pick it, right after you pick it, the sugars that are in there, okay. the reason they call it sweet corn, start turning to starch right away. So corn that's picked that day should be eaten that day. That's, that's what we feel like. So it doesn't travel well. So buy, unless you buy it from a farm, it's really right, much better. Right, you don't know how long it's been right. on the truck and then how long it's been in the cooler. You know, keeping it in the refrigerator helps a little, but. Your corn is good. Yeah. What do you find the best way to cook corn? I like to cook it, uh, my rule of thumb is for every ear, I give it one minute. Okay. Um, I, I put a, about an inch of water in the pan. All right, so and, steaming more than yeah, boiling. Yeah, steaming more than boiling, and mm -hmm. once I get over eight ears, and, or rather eight minutes, then that's the top. So I okay. don't give it more than eight minutes regardless. And, okay. And I like to do it just before we're about to eat so that it doesn't sit and cook, keep cooking nice. as we're waiting for everything else. But that's, that's just my method of of doing it. Wonderful. That sounds perfect. And you ha don't have a perfect table in this. You've got flowers from your cut garden. That's right. Yes. <laughs> yeah. This time of year, as, as some people have mentioned to me, their cut gardens are starting to wane a little bit. It's right. hot and they've been through a few droughts. And uh, But we have a pick your own flower garden and herbs. So right. we keep them looking great. So if you're having an event or just want your weekly dose of flowers, come on in and pick from our stuff. And that leaves your garden so you can look at it and it looks nice. Great and, ideas. Uh, it's by the pound and we've got literally thousands and thousands of, of blooms out there. Everything you need for August. That's Thanks, right. Greg. Thank you. Take care. Now I should mention that Spring Ledge Farm is recognized as a farm of distinction by the New Hampshire Department of Agriculture. You can certainly stop in this weekend for yourself for locally grown vegetables and fruits, as well as beautiful ornamental plants, greenhouse crops, and of course, farm fresh food. Directions and full information are at springledgefarm.com.